Welcome back. This is PTE 14.3. This is KO in a tank shooting a P4 in the tracks with one hit. One hit kill. I hope this doesn't make it into the game. I hope this is a PTE specific bug because this is going to be a very big problem. Pretty sad. This video you can see has no views. I sent this in during PTE 14.2 to the devs. I figure I'll let you see it because then you can exploit it and then maybe it'll become a problem and then it'll get fixed. So like just on console, you know how we can't uh, look at the map while taking down nodes now because on console, they would open up the map in order to double the speed of taking it down. Yeah. So we'll get penalized for it. So now yep. here, just whoa, lay on a whoa, tank whoa. gun. I'm black again. And, and not only can you block his entire okay. view, his entire screen is black. He cannot yep, move no, the turret, nope, and the machine gun anywhere. can't shoot you. All right, I'm just gonna, so I'm at, gonna shoot at this point with the game, if if they're not going to fix these things or actually take right. people's advice and and they want to link for the AP. bugs that you've had, oh. and they're not even going to look at them, then I'm just going to stop caring. Right. Like I'm overall, do HE now. and I'm not being paid by these people, so I'm done further testing your game when this is basic stuff that you should be able to figure out. It wasn't broken before; it's broken now. So. Let's get it fixed. Yeah, it's not nothing. that hard, but I hope to see you guys exploiting this in game. It's this building here. This one's really easy. This one's been in the game for two years. Go to this wall. It's on yeah, Carrington. You can see it. You know the spot. Just go to this wall and jump. Just stand here. That's all you have to do. Yeah. And look, oh, magically what you're 50 fuck? meters in the air. You, this is something Black Matter could have now? fixed mm -hmm. years ago. Yeah, it never got oh, fixed. No, it appeared. still exists so in the game. You're going up, you're they claim oh, they're oh, they're taking a look at it to fix it. We'll see if it ever gets fixed. It should be fixed. You get a pretty oh good God. view up here oh, it's, of everything it, it looks like you're, and here i'm just showing moonfell how to get up there up which is simple just walk oh up to the wall God. and jump don't run just oh stand next God. to it and jump and there you go you, what the? you wonder yeah, why you're getting hit from bullets in the sky if you walk south this is probably why if you walk south you'll fall but you can walk like pretty okay. much pretty sad i hope it gets fixed this house for sure. a simple invisible I bar set above there would prevent you from even jumping up there so simple fix i hope Next, we're going to move on to some slides. As you can see, I have put a crossbar vertical and horizontal. This is the Sten with the grease gun overlay. You should be able to see the difference here. This is so obvious. Again, I've sent this in to Team 17. I posted it in their Discord. I linked to the bug fix for f with all these images. The, if I can do this, then... Surely the professionals can do this, right? Like, surely you guys, the experienced devs, the gods, should be able to at least center the guns and make things proper, right? Like, is that a lot to ask? Is that hard? You know, like, I mean, I, I assume living in a wheelchair for the rest of your life is fucking hard. So if you can't center the guns and you're a multi-million dollar corporation with, you know, game designers, then... There's a big problem happening that you are overlooking. And instead of making adjustments to try to fix what's already broken, maybe start with the visual stuff, the, 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 the very simplest of things, like making the guns the same damn size. I really don't understand why this is that fucking hard. Look how big the Sten is compared to the grease gun. It's horrendous. Hey, at least they got the centering right right like uh, i mean bravo i mean i know that was hard and probably took months but this is pathetic this is why the british guns suck not only that look at look at the part that rounds the eyesight it's is it round is that even round i mean i i see like flat flat edges like who made this like i could make that and make it look more round so i i i don't know i don't know what what to say here at least they got that one right. Rear sight sits to the to the right. Now this one, think of this in the circle in the middle as a as a pizza, right? Look at the slices. You have the you can tell that the right side of the rear sight sits over to the right compared to center. Like why can't we get that right? Like this people have been making first person shooters forever and for some reason this development team cannot seem to figure out where center is on their screens it's absolutely baffling to me
So that, that one's plain as day. The Lewis gun. Did did you guys even look at the Lewis gun? Did, did you even check it out? Because this hasn't changed. I don't care if you made the eyesight a little bigger. Look at the very center, vertical, horizontal. That's a problem. You don't think that's a problem? You think that's that's good? Is the PTE going on just so that maybe they can get some things fixed that's just good enough for everybody else to miss? Attention to detail is what Black Matter did so elegantly, even though they were not capable of fixing some of the massive bugs in the game. At least they had extreme attention to detail. This is not that fucking hard to do. This is... All these images took me an hour or less to make in Photoshop. So I really hope they actually take a look at these images because it's so glaringly obvious as to what the problem is with the goddamn British. It's so fucking easy. It's right in front of your eyes and you can't even see it. Hipfire shoots to the left. You see that bullet? I got it marked. That's a bullet in hipfire. And that's like... 70 meters away. Why is the bullet shooting what's probably six meters to the left at that range? Like, what, what's up with that? Do we not know where center is? Is that, like, a hard thing to find? It, it, it's got to be because it, it either has to be or you, are, you literally didn't spend any time fixing these actual, actual guns. It's just fucking sad at this point in time. And, you know, if the dumpster fire continues, expect more of the player base to go away. And that's fucking sad. Like, I've been here through this game for a long goddamn time. I've been making videos for years. I, I have a deep fucking passion for this goddamn game. And it's just being shit on by people with fucking muddy boots stepping all over it. And it's pathetic at this point. Grand overlay. Gun is too wide. Look at the hands. Yeah. Uh, how can you not tell that th that the grand and the hands sit thinner? Why not just thin that shit down? Just make it a little thinner. Y you have all the guns in the game. You can take screenshots just like I can. You can see the visual discrepancies. It's so fucking goddamn obvious. But hey, at least I got the gun centered, right? But again, the pizza. Look at the top of the pizza in the four squares. The, the top part is bigger. So, like, you're going to be able to see enemies a little easier. That's kind of nice. Although, you know, the other guns, as you'll see, aren't, aren't like that. And so they should go through and find all the guns with the sights, put this same vertical horizontal lines through it, figure out where center is and through the, and through the sights that Black Matter did, and you'd figure out real quick where you keep messing up. Here you go. Rear sight sits to the right. Again, look at look at the right half of that quadrant. It's larger than the left half. And that's because your rear sight isn't centered. It doesn't matter what you do to the very front tip of the gun. If the rear sight isn't centered, it's always going to be off. And people have been making first-person shooters forever. And for some reason, this company just cannot seem to understand what they're doing wrong. MK5 grand overlay. If I got the guns wrong, you know, don't don't hate on me or let me know in the comments because uh, I was trying to whip through the PTE and I wasn't having good luck with uh, recording it. I, I don't know why that is. But anyways, MK5 grand overlay gun size and sight is inaccurate. Well, look at it. Like how much more blatantly obvious can it be that something's wrong with the guns? Look at the size of that sight. Look at the width of the gun on screen. Like, why? Why? Did the, did the British have bigger hands and, like, much bigger guns? Is that how uh, the war evolved? Is, it, you know, where we're just like, we like things bigger and better, so we do it bigger and better. Like, is that, is that what we're going with, or are we going for some consistency? One thing the game lacks more than anything is consistency. But, hey, I mean, at, at, at least they got the sight centered, right? P14, grand overlay. P14 is too big, sight is too big. Again, they could easily go back and look at the hands. Look at the hands. It's it, it's not that hard to figure out. Look at the centering of the grand. Look at like the little arms to the right and left of the actual sight. If they 
squished the British gun down and matched it with those the left and right ears, whatever you call them, um, that'd be a great start to fixing the problems with the British. But again, it's going to go ignored because for some reason, these details just seem to not get transferred to the right people that can actually go, yeah, this is messed up. We should fix this. But instead, you're going to go through and you're going to make all these little adjustments to prevent the sway, which while holding your breath, which all these pitchers are holding breath, you are still, there's still a sway even when holding the breath. It's very minor, but it's there. So if you're going to make all these little adjustments, how about actually making the most glaringly obvious adjustments? I I don't know. You want people to play the British? You're trying to kill the other half of the player base? Like, I, I really don't know what you're doing. But if I showed this to any any game developer on the planet, they would think this is two different games. And that's saying a lot. P14. Rear sight sits too low. Look at the quadrant. Someone's getting two larger pieces of pizza. And yeah, I sent these to them. Exactly how you see them right here. Because I don't even care anymore. If you guys aren't going to pay attention to the details, then then I'm not going to play the PTE anymore. And I'll end up just having to move on. I'm looking forward to uh, Burning Lands coming out. I really hope that's a hit because I, I see a lot of the player base ditch and hell let loose for that game. And this and this is because of your own incompetence. And you'll have nobody to blame but yourself. And this will be a massive $45 million mistake that will be talked about for the next decade. But look at it. The grand. When I had the grand one, you could see the, the top half of the quadrant. The grand, you could see a little bit more. It was a little larger than the bottom half. But in this one, it's the exact opposite. You see a little more in the bottom. It's... It, it, People say that you need to lower the front sight. Well, that's not the case because the front sight is actually flawless. What they need to do is change the rear sight. The rear sight needs to move up. It This isn't fucking rocket surgery. So assuming that you need to move the front sight down, the front sight is centered. And you can clearly see it here. There, there should be no disagreement with that whatsoever. The rear sight sits too low. You need to move the rear sight up. Pretty Pretty simple. Maybe move it closer to the screen. I don't really know. But something needs to change. Let's take a look at some of the other issues in the game. Check out this one. This is just a guy in game testing out the weapons on LL I mean, He's firing the boy's AT rifle. No wonder the faces look so fucked up in the game. Because when the guy fires, the flash is actually happening right in his face. Um, and not to mention firing the boy's AT rifle... There's no tracer. So you don't actually see where the bullet goes. Like, I, I why? Why is that a thing? Like, did you guys even try it? You guys are going to be playing on Sunday. Um, are, are, how are you going to feel about it when there's these kinds of issues in the game that you're about to play? Because um, I've never believed you that any of you have played the game. And if you have, I would love to see your Steam profile. Let's see how many hours you've actually put into Hell Let Loose. Proof is in the pudding. We'll see how much of a passion you actually have for this game or if this is just a job. We'll find out. Look at this one. It's firing out of his hand for some reason. I, I just can't even explain it. Um, this is almost like you're literally delivering on the Update 15 trailer. Like, you literally thought that was such a good trailer, everything was so good, that you're literally putting the shit in the game. It's embarrassing. Check out this one. The bullet, I, I, there wasn't a frame where it actually comes out of his head, but in-game, it looks like the bullet is firing out of his head. This is just us three in the server on, on, on the British side. That's it. Look at where that bullet is. I, I don't even know what to say. Like, that's a real thing? Like, the bullets just pretend flash coming out of the gun and bullets actually coming out of the forehead? I mean, this is this is grade A development here. Look at this one. Here's another example. Uh, it's coming out of his forehead. The bullet is shooting out of his forehead for some reason. Doesn't make sense. This is the Lewis gun, if you're wondering. Um, I, really wasn't worth testing any other guns. Like, I can tell that they didn't do what was required to fix it and to bring it up to Black Matter's standard. I don't even think you understand what that sentence actually means. Look at this one. This is just a separate bullet. And where's that one going? 
Well, it didn't like ricochet. Um, so where's that bullet headed off to? It's, it's baffling. That's about it. Like, I, I really hope they dial this shit in. I, I, honestly, I, I give them a year minimum to, to bring this game back into working order. And that's terrible. If, if you would have just reverted the game back to update 13, none of this would have happened. Like, I, I know I, I tried with a petition. Some people think petitions are stupid. Um, that really wasn't the case for other games that have used petitions. So I really thought that there would be a ton of people who would want the game to be reverted back, fix the issues, and then move forward with the British update. Now you've removed your whole calendar just to have to work on the stuff that you've broken. And and you think this kind of stuff is acceptable? Like this this is this is ready for the PTE? Or are you trying to save face and rush things out? Because that worked for you so well for the last two months. I mean, like you might as well try it a third time, right? Third time's a charm. So you might as well just try to rush it out and pretty much say, fuck the player base, the rest of them. And, and who cares? Like, cause you guys don't care and we can see it. Like we can see that you don't care. So we know that you don't care. Um, it's awful, man. It, it hurts the heart that this is how this game is gone. And I just, really have lost hope that this game is ever going to be fixed. And because I'm not a liar, I'm not going to sit here and tell you, oh, guys, wait, man, the game's going to be better in the future and all this other crap. It's not. It's not. We have absolutely seen what they're capable of. We are not using a brand new engine that would take time to learn. Uh, you bought a game that was already in working order and you literally shit on it. And now people don't want to play it because it's infuriating to play. The guns don't work. The, the hit reg in the game is horrendous. The tanks, the hit reg on the tanks is terrible. These are the prime elements of a first person shooter. And we can't even get that dialed in. So if you guys aren't going to actually focus on the main core components of a first person shooter, and you think the in-game store and the training center is the basic training, which should be a size of a whole map where you actually have to drive around. And, you know, that that has segments of it that make you go through the actions of building a garrison and an OP, kind of like was how Squad does it. Then nobody's going to learn. Like anything right now that you can do in the basic training, you can do in a fully empty server with one friend. So I don't understand it. And what I can't stand about the basic training is that in order to get a helmet headshot, you actually have to hit him in the helmet or to get the headshot sound. You have to hit him in the helmet in the PTE. That's not how the game is. And, and if they've changed that, that's a big problem because the game has always been shooting someone in the face gets you the helmet, the helmet sound, but not in the PTE. In that, you actually have to hit the helmet, which makes no sense. And, and really leads me to think that you might have messed with something um, in, in the game. And that's, that's just going to be really, really bad. So I hope it's just like the helmets added onto the scarecrow and like that's what's making the sound. So like I hope that's it and not the actual game. Time will tell. But this is the most disappointing video I've ever made. And... I figured this one, you deserve to see my emotional reactions to the things I'm saying because they have shit all over this game and your attempts to fix it have been lackluster and pathetic. And I really hope you guys go back to the drawing board and fix the, fix what you've broke. That's all we're asking. We'd be fine if you just fixed the shit that you broke because it was fine before. Not perfect, but it was fine. Until next time, guys, take care. Have a good weekend. Talk to you soon.